What's up guys, I am Jigsaw and this is my first time playing Remnant from the Ashes. I will start a new series with this game because I heard that it's quite good. So make sure you destroy that like button and subscribe if you want to see more parts of this coming soon. I'm quite pumped about this game so let's jump right in. Let's create the character. Hmm. This could be useful. Well, this looks badass. Nah, hell no. Nah, I think I'll let him bolt. Oh, homie, hell no. I think I gi I'll give him a full beard. This looks nice. Yeah, definitely. This one. This could be useful. Hmm. Wonder what this is. This looks like it could be useful. Nah. This looks like it. This looks like it was important. This one suits you the best. Let's go. And offline. So let's go. What can we do when our last hope fails? That you must discover. Our last hope sailed this sea before you, in search of an end to the beasts that have hunted us for generations. An end was found, or so we thought. When the dragon rose into the sky like a phoenix, blazing in flames of agony. But our hero never came home. Only the storm, the beasts, the unshakable dread that something had twisted and turned. The journey would not be easy. Storm swirls round the dragon's tower like a shroud. The dragon may be dead, but in its ashes, I fear something else has awoken. You will fight for every step. You must reach the tower, learn what became of our warrior, face what lurks within. Oh no! What? How can he survive that? When our last hope fails, another shall take its place. So long as we have breath. Well, that was a nice intro. By the way, if you guys are wondering, I'm playing on a gaming PC. So the graphics might be different on console. All right, let's go. Well, the graphics 
the graphics look amazing. First auto crunch. The touching system seems uh, very fluid. I'm surprised. It reminds me of uh, Darksiders. Consumables are for temporary aid. They can be found in the world or purchased from merchants. Alright. Doesn't look so good. Yeah. Yeah. The combat seems so smooth. Come on, homie. Bring it up. But I wonder what's the story behind uh, those monsters? What are they? Is this a post-apocalyptic game or what? But I am... I am pleasantly surprised about the graphics, man. Look at this. This is like real world graphics. Yeah, there are more of you. I'm really enjoying the combat, man. I mean, the character doesn't seem to have a lot that advanced graphics, but the, the world around me is very detailed. The rain system seems amazing. Slow. What a nice view. What can I say? This is an open area. There might be monsters. Or a cutscene, why not? You're done. Am I supposed to save him or what? Hang on. I guess so. Oh, it's just a cutscene. Came too late. Finally, some action. Please let me kill them.
Come on, homie, you got this. Or not. Hang in there. Hurry You're up, gonna be it. okay. We got company. Move. Move. So they got guns, but I've I got a sword. That's not a fair fight. Hi there. Whoa, whoa, take it slow. You got hurt real bad. You don't want to start bleeding again, do you? Who are you? Where am I? Ward 13. It's safe here. Maybe the only safe place there is. I'm Wallace. I wanted to see you. I asked the commander if I could. How did I get there? Oh, Commander Ford. She's in charge. Oh, Commander Ford and Mr. Riggler found you outside. They brought you here. But they said... They said Mark wasn't coming back. Was that Mark outside? But he's... Was... Never mind. The commander sorry, said kid. you should come see her when you woke up. She's in the room down the hall. She'll find a place for you. Everyone's got a place. Yeah, but not me. I'll see you later. I'm a tough guy. I don't have a place. Oh my god, the graphics, man. So, where to go now? Talk to the commander for. So, where is she? Here. There you are. Well, well. What's up, lady? Who's awake? You put up quite a fight outside our gates. It's with Riggs downstairs. If everything checks out here, I'll see you get it back. I'm Commander Ford. This is my base, and you, friend, are an unexpected guest. So why did you save me then? I thought to know the kind of people I bring into Ward 13. We haven't seen a living soul on that shore for weeks. You will tell me why you were really out there, or I'm trying we'll to get you. to the island tower across the water. I don't need to tell you anything. Well. I don't think being rude is going to get me anywhere. Hmm. No one has been in that tower in a very long time. But you've got no chance of getting there in this storm. Truth is, the ward has been cut off. We had to block the gates after we dragged you in. The root are everywhere. The root? But, now that you're here... I have an idea. I'll tell you what. You want to leave? You'll have to do something for us first. Uh, tough choice. What can I do? First, we need power. That storm knocked out our reactor recently. With enough power, we might be able to activate another way out of here. Where is the reactor? Another way out? Well... You the reactor, reactor is on the lower basement level. There's a stairwell that leads basement. down to it. Get it running, then come back here. Alright then. Nothing around here is easy. Watch your back. All right, all we right. already lost a man down there a few days ago. I suspect the root have found a way in. Go check in with Riggs. About your blade. I don't imagine your fists will do much against the root. You do this for us, and I'll make sure you get out of here. 
All right, lady. Find the reactor on the base lower level. So let's go get that blade then. <coughs> they left me defenseless. Yeah. Scrap. That might be useful later. What is this? Or not? Hey, people! I hope you can restore the power soon, stranger. Without light and heat, our weakest won't last long. Well, uh, what's this? Worry, man. Hey, it's good to see you on your feet again. Uh, welcome to Ward 13. I did what I could to patch you up. You seem like a tough one, though. <laughs> Name's Rigler. <laughs> Most everyone calls me Riggs. Well, your uh, sword mm, was pretty banged up in the fight. Mm, not much I could do with it, I'm afraid. The blade was shattered when we found you. Mostly scrap metal at this point. Think I remember Ace mentioned she found a few weapons out in the city. Maybe she'll help you out. Oh, well, uh, last I heard, Ace went down to check out the reactor. Good luck down there. Uh, so... Yeah. So I'm supposed to fight without a weapon or what? Give me this at least. Who are you, lady? Keep walking, stranger. Come on! Wait a second! You lost? Well, here's hoping the root haven't found a way into the lower My level. goodness! So I need to go there without a weapon? Come on, mate! Oh my god, those graphics. Good yeah. I get scrapped for days. Yeah. Hey friends. The actors just through that door and down the stairs. Keep your wits about you. Well, I'm gonna just break your things around here. If you don't mind. Even if you do, I don't care. So, worth 13 access. What is this? Control level 1, reactor B1, worth 13, research. Alright. Oh my god. Those graphics, man. Damn it, Les. Where are you? I'm not sure if there's, there's a difference in graphics between the uh, console and PC. Because on uh, PC it looks amazing. Even the stairs. Well, another cutscene. Hello, sweetie. What? Where the hell did you come from? You nearly scared the life out of me. No one else wandering around down here. Uh, you're not from around here, are you? Name's Ace. Ace Cotterell? You? Well, the first one. Is that right? Well, you found it. Starting that relic could mean trouble, though. So, you ever start a reactor? Nope. Well, it makes a lot of noise, for starters. Lucky for you, it's just the press of a button on the terminal above us. Would have done it myself, but without knowing what might come sniffing around. With the two of us, though. Maybe we got a chance. Okay, so I have an idea. You go upstairs and start the reactor. I'll help you kill whatever comes our way. You probably need a weapon, huh? Let's see if I can find you something. Finally! Select your archetype. 
Well, Hunter, the Hunter specializes in long range combat, armed with an ultra precise Hunter hunting rifle, sturdy Reaper pistol, versatile scrap sword. The Hunter excels at taking out targets before they get close. That's nice. Hunter's Mark marks enemies, allowing the Hunter and their teammates to see targets through the walls. That's like. Um, Wall hacks in Counter Strike. It also increased critical hit chance against marked targets. Well, that's nice. It's got nice, uh, nice outfit. The X class special mid range combat and support, armed with a powerful coach gun. Uh, Mender's aura casts an area effect heals that. Gradually restores health for all teammates. So that means I will have teammates. Scrap. Shotgun. Scrap hammer. Close the enemy. Hot shot imbues their ammunition with fire giving it a chance to set enemies on fire. I think I'll go with this one. It seems uh, the most offensive character. There, that should improve our odds. Get up there and start the reactor. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. But where's my outfit, lady? So this is my inventory, I have a hammer, a shotgun, a pistol, and some basic outfits, inventory, trades. Get up there and start the reactor. Alright, alright, don't push me. Get on! Are you kidding? One shot? Dude, this shotgun is so OP! Let's try the hammer! Come on! Give me a challenge. So I heard that that uh, there's no way to change the difficulty in this game. There's only one that is uh, progressing. Let's see in the settings, but it doesn't pause the game. Chill out! Now what? <laughs> Did it! Saved your ass too! Who saved who? Don't feel bad. We're live and the power's back on? I'd call that a win. Oh, shut up! Let's go check in with Ford. Come visit my shop sometime, yeah? I'll make sure to give you the need some help out there discount. 
My goodness. So, gameplay difficulty something. Damage, damage, damage. Yeah, I believe there's no difficulty setting on this game. Return to Commander Ford. Alright. Huh? Hey, hey, wait up! <coughs> Figures. Sure, it's good to have some light around here. Don't you say? You're risking a lot for folks you don't know, stranger. Ah, uh, yes. You're trying to get yourself to that little island, yeah? Word moves fast when there ain't many words left around here. Listen, friend, uh, I know you don't know me from a can of paint, but I want to help. You, uh, you got a feeling of destiny about you. <laughs> You're gonna save the world, ain't you? Uh, maybe? That's the spirit. Uh, here. I want you to have this. Not many people can keep the spirits out there in the world. An old friend told me this little bobble could keep you for death at bay. At least for a while. And if you're looking to buy other treasures for your travels, come see me. Ace has got our own space over there. <laughs> Between us, we got all sorts of treasures. With that stone there, free of charge. Take good care of it. Oh, one more thing. Ellen, uh, <laughs> Commander Ford, she knows more about that island than she lets on. Uh, Ask her about the founder of War 13. She'll get you on your path. <laughs> Good to see a new face around here. Dragon Heart can be used to replenish lost health. There are a limited number of uses before its power is depleted. Dragon Heart charges are replenished after resting at a checkpoint or die. Oh, so this is a health item. Alright. Commander Ford, here I'm coming. What's up, lady? The game seems so polished. I mean, the <sighs> combat is so smooth. The graphics are amazing. I really want to know the story behind all of this. Glad to see you got the reactor running. <laughs> and I see Reggie gave you the dragon heart. <sighs> he wouldn't part with an artifact that powerful without a good reason. Then. I imagine he said I could help you. <laughs> Very well. Reggie may play the old fool, but his judgment is rarely off the mark. You've proven yourself reliable, stranger. I'm willing to help you get on your way. I'll take that. What I help I can get. I'll take what I help I can get. What a fool with the press I don't need your help. But I doubt you'll last long out there without help. Go see Riggs and McCabe downstairs. They'll fit you with better gear. Come see me afterwards. Oh yeah. I think uh, this is the time to get some armor. Upgrade equipment with recent armor. So the armory was around here. Ah! No, not this. Hey friend, 
Ah, thanks for getting the power back on. Ford mentioned we should help you get sorted for the city, as a thanks for getting us out of a bind. Ah, maybe we can put your old blade to good use after all. Ah, let me look. Bricks can upgrade your guns and armor with materials found in the world. Alright. So, armor... I don't know, the shotgun seems already pretty OP. From 52 to 57, that's not that much. 17 to 18. Mm. All right, hey, now that's better. Oh, and uh, take this. It's not the strongest stuff, but more protection. Finally! Than what got. Ah, there you go. A bit sturdier. Every little bit counts out there. Bring it on, homie. Can you even spare the supplies? I found, I guess, Ford ordering me around is not like that. It's true. We don't have much, but. You did right by us. Best we do right by you. If you need any weapon upgrades in the future, come see me. McCabe over there will help you out with the augments for your gear. But, uh, stick to business talk. You know, she's not much for chat beyond her work. Alright, if you say so. So, this chick. What's up? What's up? So you're the stray Ford was talking about. We got plenty of mouths to feed without taking in random drifters. Apparently taking out a few root is enough for our commander, though. Ouch. Ford's gonna give my time to every stray who wanders in. And we're having words. I'm McCabe. I'm the engineer. And you're a pain in my ass. I'm not some scrap peddler, got it? I don't upgrade trash. Well, you look like a man. What's up with the ass commentary? Right? It's the apocalypse. I can be as grumpy as I damn well please. Let's see what we're dealing with here. You're looking to lay down some serious hurt. Use this to burn those weeds to the ground. That's all you get for now. Get me more components and I'll make more. For a fee. Now get out of here. I'm tired of your yapping jaw. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Hotshot, the weapon's mother used to augment the power of your ranged weapons. When equipped, the weapon generates mod power by inflicting damage on enemy targets. When the power meter is full, press F. Alright. Some weapons mod activate immediately, others activate the alternate fire mode. What can be equipped by going into the inventory screen, selecting a range of. Alright. Well, well, well. So, this is the weapon mod. I think I'll equip this uh, on the shotgun. Ammunition with fire increasing damage dealt by 20%. Shots also have a 100% chance to apply the burning effect. Nice! Nice! I think I made the right choice with this uh, character. So in a bit, return to Commander Ford. Wait a second, is that a wheel around my shoulder? Yep! Okay. Still can't get over this graphics, man. Commander Ford! Here you are. Good to see you more equipped. Riggs and McCabe do good work. 
I hope this will be enough to get you on your way. We can't leave by the gates now, but the Founder, my grandfather, gave me this key years ago. He said we should only use it when there's no other choice. Well, we are out of choices. Considering you stuck your neck out for us, it seems fitting you do the honors. Take it. There's a terminal downstairs in the main room. Use the key there. With any luck, we can get the thing running. Well, here's hoping it doesn't. Well, that's very reassuring. So, where should I go? Inventory traits, map, options, map. I honestly don't like the map. It doesn't seem very detailed. You might get lost here. I heard you helped Ace turn the lights back on. Thank you. That's not it. Maybe here? Yep. That seems precious. Really something, isn't it? I, I read about it, but I never saw it working. This red eye might be our only door to the outside world now. You want to get out of here? This is your shot. My grandfather was the commander before me. They called him the founder of Ward 13. He brought everyone to Ward 13 when the Root first attacked. He was determined to learn where the Root came from. He spent so much time out there, searching. And one day, he didn't come back. I never knew what happened to him. Still alive? There's a room just outside the ward. All his notes, any hint of where he went, it's there. If you want to reach the atoll, he may be the last one who knew how to get there. Listen, I know this has all been a bit rough for you. Been rough for everyone. But you came through for us. For that, I'm grateful. You're welcome back anytime. Good luck. Well, thanks. So that means I am on my own now. That means uh, I can go to the outside world. Let's see what happens if I touch this. Yeah, activate the red eye. So this is a checkpoint, basically. So difficulty normal, but you can't um, bump that up. You can't lower it, you can do nothing. Whatever. Earth Founders Hideout. Yeah, why not?
I'm dying not to waste about it, always thought the route would get me a lot of driver like you. But we can't all be free or lose your memories of of things he can stop the wood, you know that the rest of us are just trying to live our lives between the best we can. We and Ellen have had to do it without you. Alright, let's get it. What's this consumable spot scene? Oh, oil skin toxin. I want a DG card, that might be useful. Seeing that is that the map? Orange teleporter map level two labyrinth. But I can screenshot this, unfortunately. I want you to know that I love you. I'm sorry, sorry for so many things, words, from this, this. Goodbye. All right. Find the subway entrance. This area reminds me a lot of Dark Side of Street. I mean, the textures, the city, the aspect of it, and the enemy crawling. This is definitely inspired by Dark Side of Street. Headshot. Uh. I gotta be honest with you guys, I'm feeling this game. Especially the combat system. That's that. My god, this game is so beautiful. Even the water. For the graphics, I would give it a 10 out of 10. This could break? <coughs> nah. So, there's the checkpoint, but... Why? Why not? God, that's a big one. Oh my God. I dodged that! Dude, I dodged that! 
How did he got me? But I'm not giving up, not yet. So the enemies respawn. Now what? So we are not dead? Yeah. I don't know what I'm supposed to do around here, but farm those enemies. Or get to that that checkpoint. I really hope I got enough ammo for this. So the enemies drop ammo. That's nice. Not again! Run, Nick! Run! Run, not, not just stay there. Oh God. This is stupid. Enough! Zoom into the quest. That was rough. Yeah, it was. I'm in trouble. Give me this. So now we're that's blocked. I'm in trouble. I'm bleeding again. Ah. So 
So where am I supposed to go? Founder Ford knew a way to the atoll, but he's been gone for years. I found a note that said he went to speak with someone called the Root Mother in the old church near Subway Stop. Maybe this Root Mother knows where oh, the founder is. This ain't good. Bleeding still won't stop. So. Go to that checkpoint. I have no health potions, no nothing. Nice. Just won the lottery. So I've been there. Whatever, man. I guess there's nothing here. I see something shiny. Where's that ring? I really need to get some health back. back. Resting a checkpoint replenish ammo on dragon hearts at the cost of respawning or oh, basically. Yeah, that's nice. So I think that's it for today guys. I think I've been playing this game for like one hour. I don't know how 
I don't know how long this video will really is. Uh, let me know in the comments uh, down below what you think about this game. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.